All right, my friends. A day of intrigue today. I want you to enjoy with me this day. As I said, the sun. We prepare for our pizza. Let's take another look at this. Ah. Well, you say it's not enough cold, huh? You'll get there. You want to just slow roast this. It's about a seven, eight hours cooking. Is your cook? Look at that. Come on, go with me. We're going to take a ride. Check on some things as to what we need to get done. The communal construct. How about that? Calling my Cadillac here. Let me get on my Cadillac. I certainly would like to love to find one of these. I purchased this, uh, I don't know how many years ago. I got it from Alabama. I got it for, it only had, it had 300 plus hours on it. Today it has 1,500. And I purchased it from a fellow in Alabama, his father had a large farm and uh, he died. You're not going to find anything like this for that price. It is filthy as they come. Let's take a ride over. Let's look. I want to see if I can find things that I can utilize here. I'll take you to one of my most prized places, all right? Let's look and see what's happening. Ah, oh, the sun is quite bright. Shining right in my face. I'm going to take you over to the shop first. Check all that stuff you need. Yeah, I'm coming down. This garden right here one time produced broccoli big as basketballs. We have grown a tremendous amount of food here. Friend Akiusipia. He says hello to the people. You'll see him all. He's the one that plays. That's our friend. Uh, uh, precious. This is our. We've never tried this bird. It is called the Asa. Uh, but we have going with the uh, golden comets. Yeah, we eat eggs here. It's amazing how there are those that will tell you that chickens are unclean, and they're not. See all those birds there? I know it's wet, but they love it. They'll be all right. Stretch, they can eat, and everything. We need eggs. But this at one time was a beautiful garden right here. The shop right here. This junkie. Old cars and things. We never throw anything away. Zakin, our leader. He has. This is our business here. So if you're all in this area, need any kind of service, we will do it. Victory Tree Service. They're experts. Nothing they can't do. See? The OT. We're legit. And he's in here working on. This is our leader to be. How did this one get out? All ready to get out. Huh? Trying to uh, change the transmission. We purchased this when we first came here. 
And we're going to ride it home. He's changing, trying to rebuild the transmission. One transmission went out. Now he's, you see this old truck here? You could not even buy one of the bed alone. I could sell that today, we could, for $5,000. We paid $12,000 for this about 15 years ago. You can't find one at that price today. So we have a full-fledged shop over here, see? We built it out of things that were dis discarded. See that paneling up there, keep it warm and cool? They come out of old chicken houses. It's one of our trucks. Which one are you working on? This one right here? That one right there. Well, I'll get this one on Charles so I can get it out. Okay. How is that one right there? Uh, I'm, I'm going to test it, see how it does. Okay. We'll go from there. This is our Zakini right here. This is our Shalom. leader being prepped for, to run things. It is the one that uh, nothing he can't do. You see the shop? I used to fuss all the time. I don't even mess with him no more. We built this shop. All these vehicles, they can do it. Everything we need, well, thing. But he is our leader, and uh, he is going to guide this community. I'm getting older. Summer is coming, so we need to get things done. All right, my son, I'm going. All right. I tell you, when I tell you I got grills, I got grills. <laughs> this is an old mama. I, I'm going to get this out. I'm going to get this out this summer because she will, she will cook. This is a big grill. And it's sitting out here with, oh. We haven't used it in years. Ouch. You have to understand, I used to love, I used to cook all this, I used to cook once a week. See that old big rusty thing right there? I think I paid $700 for it. I could get more than that for it right now. It's a water pump, you can pump tens of thousands of gallons and irrigate. This is the curdy place over here. Tractors and everything. These sprayers and all of that. I don't mess with it. See, there's another grill. I probably got 15 grills. This is the side that is the most valuable side. We do everything from this side right here, everything. This is the grill. I need to work on it. But I could be grilling on that side, and the heat will come here, and I'm cooking all kinds of things in this side. We had, we had quite a bit of people here then. Let me. One day I'll show you the picture of how many people we had here at that time. For some hard to be wrong, they would still be there. You think so? We are people that have our own ideas. Forgive me. We'll clean that out. Let me just get this squared away. We are people that no one's going to tell us nothing. You're not coming here with that. None of them. Let me check on some things. Spend a little time with you today. As we prepare for the Pesach. Beginning. We Shabbat on Friday night service. And we're going to have a great time. What a blessing. What a blessing. You have to stretch that out for you all. I didn't know we had that fixed for you. Actually, we don't. 
We got plenty to hunt and eat. Let's go around a little bit, nation. Let's dig a ride. I tell you, that is dusty. Two of us built that. I designed it, old telephone poles, poles and everything. That's how I designed it. Didn't have much finance. This is what we call the ugly side, but it is the operable side. We can do anything we want to in here. See that big greenhouse right there? I got that free. We had, we were raising tilapia fish there and everything. This was a community, a construct that was, uh, it was tremendous. This is what we would call the ugly part, but it's not ugly. On this side, all the men live. This were men, families lived here too. No one lives on this side anymore. We take the mobile homes and fix them up nice. They were nice. They were nice. All of these buildings. That's a nice house right there inside. That one there. They're nice homes. When we came, we had to build shower houses until we were able to create what we needed. This is what we call a new spreader here. Got that for nine hundred dollars. This is a manure spreader. Anyone interested in buying either one, give us a call. This is this tractor is just as big as the one the new one. Barn in great disrepair. First building we built when we came here out of just old stuff. But it's holding up. We'll repair it. We're building a new one across the street. Rain bins, wow. This old barn, no, this is the first barn we built. Still, she's still holding her ground. This is the first barn we built. This one here. That's so much the people of my hue can do if they weren't selfish. We built this out of just sub parts, whatever we could find. We got everything in here. This is a grain house. We grind grain and all of that. This is a hay beller and these are the implements we use around here. Ah, oh, I got another grill here. But I tell you, I got grills. I got grills. Believe me. But I say that I love cooking. Still do, but I just can't cook like I used to. See this one right here? You could put hamburgers and wieners and everything on there. You see all this equipment? All of this we purchase on the cheap. Because y'all gave me favor with people. He gave me tremendous favor with people. The hay for the animals. That was the first barn back here. This was just for hay and things. That's why I need me two beautiful families. Man that have some kind of skills. Come on. It's not hog headed. We built all of this out of just things that we bought from torn down buildings. We didn't have the funds. We did not have the money. I came out of the old boats, they used to fish and all of that. You can see. 
We need repairs on this side. We don't throw away nothing. Believe me, you'll see. Nothing. All of this. That little camp right there, that's where I lived when I first came here, my wife and I, on the other side. That was our home. I wanted to make sure others had homes before me. Equipment. That is the granddaddy right there. She would take it down there. That's what they call a full bottom plow. She'll go down to the depths of the earth. Turn the many fields over with that. And so this is what we have. I need some repairs on this building here. We got everything we need. Send us old brother that's real and wife loves ya. Loves to walk barefooted. Beautiful, simple daughter was Tizayon. That kind of a daughter is worth a value. Great usurp authority. You can't do it here. I will let you. There is no tyrant spirit here. We all expected to do the same thing. You will not come here with that. No one. And so over the years, you know things. All we don't throw away. We don't throw away. That's an old hay beller. First one we purchased. We didn't have money, so you bless me to look and to go everywhere. We purchased all this peat moss. It came from Canada. We purchased this 20 years ago. It came from Canada. We can repair this. We're going we're gonna to get it done. All these appeals that... There was a church that gave, there was a church that had these. We didn't know the people. And a person said, they want to know if you want those. That's what's in our tabernacle. I said, yeah, what they want from there, you can have them for nothing. They don't like the colors. And I certainly jumped on it. Some of you are not even familiar with machinery like this. You see this? So there's nothing we don't have that we need. Mulch layer, old corn shuckster, manure spreader. We had a full-fledged operation. Sprayers that will spray out beyond the distance, drip. We got everything, everything that we need here. People, People don't want to, uh, back in those days, I, I purchased these gaming machines, these right here, you know, golf and that kind of stuff. They're worth a little money now. They really are. So it's nothing we don't have that we need. We don't need to go out for nothing. Food, we have a supply of food here. I haven't shown you this side, but there's other sides too, but let me show you. This plow here, bottom plow. Gotta get this hay covered. But this is our community. That old Master Ferguson tractor right there. Purchased that from a uh, hillbilly. The same one I got the other stuff from. That's the way he took. He was a hillbilly, a genuine hillbilly. But I can deal with a hillbilly just like an illbilly. Y'all gave me favor with every man I met. And I don't compromise, I don't tell jokes. Uh, you're not telling jokes around me. I had the man that drilled the well for us. He said, I got a joke I want to tell you. I said, we don't tell jokes. 
You don't tell no jokes here. Well, it's not a bad one. About a black boy and a white boy. I shall remind you, sir, you tell no jokes here. None. I don't play the game. I don't tell jokes. I don't sit around laughing and clowning, acting like a foolish man. That's not me. So we have all of this. We know how. Look at this. One building we built. It's just stuff that we built. We had really nothing to build things with, no money. But I made it work. Uh, these are some, these are the, are these, okay, Australop and everything. Oh, these are birds too. This is how we made sure that our bins were not, we mounted them to these old tires. And we would fill these bins up with corn and things like that. That's how we did it. Ah, yes. This is a place where we raise, this is where our sheep, we raise chickens here on the other side. I think those are butchers there. Yeah, those are butchers back there. We gotta start butchering them and eat them. It's the greenhouse. Where everything is in here <laughs> for the chickens, that's a grinder. Listen, your grant put it, put, puts it in your heart to send an offer and send it. You will see what it's used for. I use the money righteously. I don't drive a cattle like don't eat one. And so there are chickens on this side. You can see them. Those are bird layers on that side. Those are butchers. We gotta get this clean out. Wow, that's, see all that, that dung for the sheep. This is tremendous fertilizer. You can see the birds on the other side. Maybe a little difficult. First building, one of the second building, we know this was the first. And then that one, this one. But this building has to the test of time. I'm telling you, old telephone pole, you get them free back then. You can't get anything free now. Let me look for this piece of equipment. But I'm going to spend today with you, all right? I'm looking for things to make use for the garden. That's all right. We don't throw away nothing around here. When I say that, I mean you. Nothing. This was all the king, the young one. Oh, I'm too old for that. The old drive these. This is how we get around here. Let's take a ride. I love my life. It's simple, it's beautiful. No worries. I'm more than enough for my palates. Clean foods, your grants us to eat. I was going to pay every road to have the ability that we purchased the equipment to do all that. Now I want to take you to my rich place here. Don't say nothing. This is my rich place. Let me see. They got all this locked down. I get in. Oh, let me see. Wow, I can't even get in up on this end. Let me go through on the other end. All right. This is where we grow. A muscadine is. I intended to make wine this year, but I just didn't have the energy. These 
This is a beautiful place. Right? This is a beautiful building. I'll take you inside. <coughs> this is where I have to go through here. We got to make sure we repair this. Unlock the disc repairs. Okay. How about that? Uh, I think I can leave it on the cows. But this right here, this is the... We got every... We don't, I don't throw nothing away. Nothing. So we keep diesel, uh, diesel. You that are young, you will not even know this. But this right here, we used to make our own cane. We grow and get sugar cane. Make our own cane and cook it on this right here. Cane presser, squeeze the syrup out of the cane and everything. We have this here. This, we need to clean this up. This, if you can see, these were all raised beds. I built this basically by myself. Put up all of this. All of these are raised beds. The cows get up in here now. This is the place, and that is what we call the junkyard, but it is the best place in the house. I can find anything I want over here. Nothing I cannot find. You see that greenhouse there? I found these, I found six of them. They were all like this. If a person back then wanted $6,000, we didn't have the funds. So I told another person, they bought all of them, and the person gave me this one, us. This is a greenhouse here. And we had tilapia in here, our own heat system with wood. We had tilapia and everything in here. We could grow everything in here. Tilapia on this side. Look at this, this is a nice greenhouse. Water, everything. We put it in here. We don't throw away anything. We get something free or whatever, we keep it. I don't throw away nothing. Nothing, nothing. Blackberries, we had a blackberry, we had a blueberry orchard. Old stove there, we heat this. I don't believe in throwing away nothing. You'll see. I throw away nothing. This was a very robust community and vigor was here. Still is. And this is my gold pile here. Is that much land just over here? <laughs> nothing here. All this is everything I don't throw away. Everything. It's junky. I know it's junky. We can do. I can find what I want to in here, and I find what I need for projects and everything. Believe me, the old gate right there. It can be used. Anything you want. You can find it over here. I can, because I know where it's at. All this metal that people back then would just give us, we would take it. All of that was given. All of that, where you would throw it away. These old big tires right here, we took it all. Nothing that we discarded. Those covets there, that big, everything. I'm telling you, my friends, all of this, even that old concrete. You see that concrete? We got concrete everywhere. We would utilize it. Didn't have the monies. 
machinery and stuff like that. We utilize it. You can make a nice little pin and all this strap to have a great little gathering, but we're not gonna sell it. They'll find it one day when Zakheem, if he wants to clean it up, let him do it. And I don't have the energy like I used to have, Nation. So we'll wait on that. You haven't seen this part of the community. And I wanted to show you this. Not even walking with my cane now. Let's see what we have. Beautiful, beautiful place. Beautiful it is. Oh yes, my. This was our bee trailer here. Let me show you. Raise our bees. This is what we would, our hives and everything in here. See all of this stuff? Wow. Anything I need to find is over here. Little buildings like that, we would throw them up in no time. Everything from things we found. Trucks and parts. Everything. All of this stuff was once used. Everything. Your mother who lived here, that belonged to, she's deceased. Everything from old axles. We throw nothing away. Nothing. Nothing at all. We gotta get on our electric fence, our cow, old trucks here. We had no money, so we had to purchase what we could find on the cheap. Old custom Chevy there. 110, first ground that we had, everything. We purchased that to do the roads. We were gonna pave every road and everything. So we didn't do things loxadaisia. This trailer right here has been set, nothing wrong with it. I gave old white boy Eddie Plot, he's deceased now. I like the man. I like him because he was honest. And I don't play with no man clowning. I don't. All of this old hay, hay bale of uh, square baler. That old, we would could buy, you see that big gas tank right there? You could pay $200 for that back there. And every time someone offered me something, I would buy it. Because I knew it could be used. I knew that. We built our own freezers and things with stuff like this. Okay, that's one. Just stuff like this, I'll show you. See those freezer panels? I basically built that, but it was just subpar wood and it's fallen. I'm not even worried about, worried about it now. There's nothing I can do like I used to. Those are freezer panels. We're gonna use some of them to add on to our walk-in freezer. We got everything we need here. I come to see these here. We utilize these, these bins for flower beds and growing things. The stuff has been here for years. We would buy it, I would. Railroad ties and all of that. I bought anything that could be used. This building was full of stuff here. I don't regret any of it. None of it. Stuff like this just given to us. What are you going to do with it? I'm going to use it, my friends. There's nothing I throw away. All of this I can use to build raised beds. These posts right here will cost you money. These... I'll come over here and build the raised beds here. But this place was full of everything. I'm telling you. We had everything we needed. We still do. It's junky, isn't it? 
that's all right. Wealth over here. So that's one, two, three. You gotta pull pull all these bins out and take them down for all the other stuff and grow stuff. We can't garden like a farm like we used to. All of this full of just pure junk. Everything. But it's a gem to me. I had some of the most reddish of neck white men. To be very kind to me. And they all have been. I don't play games with no white man no more than I do with a black man or Hebrew Israelite or Jew. I don't bull jive. And everyone I've met, because they knew he was an honest man because of my honesty, and I didn't jack leg with any of them. These were some beautiful raised beds right here. We grew all kinds of stuff here. All kinds of stuff. We grew it right here in these beds over here. Ah. I want to take you down and show you what we have in our. I'll show you. Not today. I'm cooking today for the Pesach. Show you one more little spot. That's it. Let me see. All right, let me close this. All right, we got to fix all this. There we go, baby. The cow's on this side here. But, uh, we built this. I built this with one person, basically. Well, the old man, Bishop Banks, or Zakin, and uh, Zakin Dawid. But the bulk of it, that was one that was me at that time. He left me, but I'm not sad because he left, because you're not coming here with your bull job. So who you are, I don't care what you bring. You bring nothing. Look at those old pines. Let me let you see, let me check. These have been here ever since we've been here. That was one huge one we cut down. Let me show you this. That big old oil tank right there. That was always full of diesel. You could buy the truck load. It was cheaper to buy by the truck load. You could buy that for, back then, $3,000. Gas was always in that one. And this was a blackberry, blueberry orchard. You see what it looks like now? We had people to work that back then. Fresh berries and blueberries and all of that. You find a very crazy generation now. So we built this building. I designed every aspect of it. Design all this, and you can see wonders and things that we have gotten. What kind of bird nest is that? And all kinds of things. We have thousands of jars up there. Built this. I designed everything. I said, no, nah, we're gonna have a two-story in this building. You can see I don't throw away nothing when I say that. Let's go up there. I just don't have the ability like I used to. I would run these steps in my day. Let me just show you some things. This is stuff I bought so many years ago. See that? See these old posts? I think I got them for little nothing. Everything. Everything. Car seats and cabinets. And look at the jars. Jars everywhere. That's how we can. Nothing wrong with the jars. That's how we did it. 
and the building, this was built. No, my friends, this was the very first, this, as far as barns, anything. And basically two of us and the two old men and I, we, all that side, it was a swamp in here, mosquitoes everywhere. We built that. Let me traverse back down. I have to be careful. In my days, I could almost jump down here. Here we go. Here we go. These are steep steps. We didn't have money back then. We still don't have money. I'm simply showing you every aspect of this. I want you to see where we come from and how we did it. I didn't do it by myself, couldn't have. It took e everyone, e them. I appreciate them. That's why you don't hear me speak against them. All of this stuff like this, old rich man gave this to me, all these mirrors, everything. He said, preacher, I'll tell you what, I'll give them to you. Like I said, all this is what we would, this, these were our gaming for the children. That's a wood burning stove right there. That's a muster. Let me see if I can go around. And stuff that we thought that was worth keeping, we would keep. But that's a stove right there. That's a monster. And all this stuff, old treadmill, I know that came from me. But we have all kinds of stuff. I didn't realize we had that much. Oh, I got to come here one day and we clean this out. Hallelujah. You want to come and work for a week, we'll feed you. You can't come foolishly. And we'll feed you and put you up. There can't be no bull jive here. Period. Carping to skills or whatever. Come on. On the cooking down there. So this is where I live. We purchased right there, that old John Deere. Man said, I don't want to sell this tractor. I said, how much you want for? I want 5,000. What he told, I had someone to bargain with him. And I pressed him and pressed him. He had rebuilt the engine and everything. So I kept pressing. He sold us the tractor. He did it. Cash, 5,000. So I'm, I am very content nation and happy what Yah has done with us here. Very appreciative. I am my young sons, daughters. There's no preference for anyone around here. Nobody gets by with nothing. We as a nation of people are cut that way. We think that we are more important than everybody. No, the community is more important. And you have no community without common unity. That's why it's community. You have to have the same unified unity. That's what you must have. It cannot be done any other way but that way. Traveling down the road, my friends, let me check on my land.
working that way. That is our soil bed. This is the composition of our soil we made with all the things across the streets and uh, manure and different things. We will enhance that. That's our, our air over there. We use all of that. We, we got to clear all of this out for our new system. Our new home. Everybody right here. What are we doing? So I am on that fine down. There you go. Come on, say shalom to everyone. No, give me a shalom, man. Give me a shalom, man. Give me a shalom to the people. Say shalom, my friend. All right, that's our strong man. Strong. All right, we get it down. All right. This is how we do it. He was born here. He's ah, uh, he's not the only we got. Quite a bit. All of our little ones, seals, they were born here. And the last one, no stranger. Went up in the daughters here for the dinner, but maybe the husband did that. I might give her a fair she, she was in she was in her internship to become a nurse. That was the semester she was going into the hospital. The hospital said that we will pay for your schooling if you promise us, give us a three-year contract. I said, no, you're not gonna do that. You're not going to be indebted to no one. And so with the LaFonts we had, I said, we'll pay for it. I'll pay for your education. And that's how that went. Let's look at this thing. All right, we got to get it done here. Mm. What we got here? All right. She's gone. You just want to do this slow and right. All right. All right. We gotta cut it off for now. So, Yabrook, my friends, be encouraged. We'll be back. Shalom.